Hi kids, I'm Mr. Steven and this is and welcome back to the kids table. Today we're going to talk about trust. Trust is when you believe deeply in somebody or something. So when Claire tells me that she made her bed when I asked her if she did so in the morning, I trust that. Should I trust that? When you tell me something, you typically do it, and I trust in that. I love Disney because Disney has so many different avenues of characters and um, things that we can learn from, like faith and trust and pixie dust helps you fly. And a snake that sings trust in me might not be all that trustworthy. But one of my favorite characters in Disney when it comes to trust is Moana. Now, Moana does not know anything about sailing. Um, she um, has this story of this demigod that may or may not be true. And she has an ocean that's kind of acting strange around her. But what she does is she trusts in the ocean. She finds a boat and she just goes out into the ocean. And that takes an absolute incredible amount of what? Trust. 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 And when she gets to this demigod on an island, does he welcome her with open arms? Or does he put her in a cave and try to steal her boat? Put her in a cave and steal her boat? That's true. That's what he does. But she still figures out how to get out of the cave and trusts in him even more. And then he takes her to this crab, this big shiny crab, and... What happens there? He sings the shiny song. He sings the shiny song. And then he tries to eat her. But she trusts that it's going to all work out. And then she comes to this terrible fire-like monster called Taka. And she looks the monster in the eyes and says, I trust you know who you are. Very, very powerful character in Disney. I wonder who your favorite characters of trust are in films. There's so many Marvel films out there right now. Which Marvel character do you trust? Which Disney character do you trust? Who do you believe in in your real life? I hope that you have, like I said, many people that you trust in. But I hope also that you have at least one. And that you're able to turn to that person whenever you are in your darkest moments. Because it's in those darkest moments that you want to have somebody or something that you can trust deeply in and trust your heart with. Thank you for joining us at the kids' table. Bye-bye. Hello, my name's Fred. <laughs> I do not trust that.